Hey team, welcome back to my channel. In this video, we're going to be looking at PostgreSQL. We're going to learn how to define enums and use them. Let us create two types. Create type, type name as enum, and then comma delimit your values. Notice here in TranType we have two. Highlight it, execute, and we're all done with that. And then create type coin type. And then we have Shiba, you know, Bitcoin, and all those. Let's go ahead and generate this type. Execute. And that is how easy it is to create a type. Once we execute the create type, SQL statement, then there's two ways of actually viewing the contents of our type in the system. The first way, go to schema, say refresh, and then come down to where it says, come on, don't be shy, come down to where it says types, and these are the two types that we just created, coin type, tran type. And the second way of looking at types is to go through PG type. Notice here, we can actually see all the types that are in the system. But what we would like to do is minimize it into the two types we just created. So highlight, generate, and notice that we have our two enum types that we just created. Now, this number over here is very, very important. And what it can be used for is to show me the columns that are made up of it. Notice that this number, 17031, I can now go through PG enum and actually get those columns, execute. And notice these are the columns buy and sell that we used inside of our enum. Here you can see I put donate before buy. Now my sort order is now to zero. Let's see if I put something in front of donate. Here you can see I said before donate, here's my value and here is my sort order. Pretty nice, yeah? Let's put something in between so you have that as experience as well. Here you can see I put between buy and sell before sell. So the value is 1.5 between buy and sell. Remember before you can say before or after. I think you understand this alter type. Before we consume a type, an enum type, we can always drop that. Notice when I execute this statement, I get our two types. I can then say drop that type. Everything is fine, and we can drop the other type as well. Now it's time to create our table. Notice on lines five and six, we have tran type and coin type. We know those are our two new enums. Let's execute this create statement. Execute, successful, and let's see where we go from here. Like I said earlier, once we consume a type, we cannot just drop it. This right here will fail. This next statement is kind of dangerous, so you must proceed with caution. Notice here that I'm gonna say drop type coin type cascade. Notice that our table crypto has a column called coin. Coin data type is coin type. Doing this command will remove this column from the table and remove the enum type. Let's execute. Notice it did it what it needed to do. I can come over here and hit refresh. And notice coin is gone. And if we go down and look at types, refresh, notice coin type is gone as well. So once again, this is very dangerous. Make sure you proceed with caution. So for the buy, you know that we have a enum for the type, the coin type, we have an enum. So now let's actually do an insert statement into the table. Let's highlight this, execute. And notice that we had 10 success, excellent. Let's uh, go ahead and delete this and let's see this next test. This next test, let's take a look at this. 
buy Bitcoin. Well, everything appears to be okay. Let's execute this and see what the error says. Notice it's giving me a bellyache on Bitcoin. Let's go and take a look-see at that enum. Is it obvious what the error is? Of course. Bitcoin, capital C, our enum has a little c. We got to fix this. So turn that to coin like that and let's try to re-execute this statement. Execute and notice everything is good now. Okay team, let's get some data out of this. Select star from crypto order by coin. Notice that doesn't look very ordered, does it? Well, remember earlier I told us to take a look at this. Do you remember when I was talking about enum sort order and this is the order that it sorts by? Remember Shiba Anu was kind of like at the top and I believe the last entry was Dogecoin. But you know, like for end users, we don't care about that. When we order, we want to see if A to Z or Z to A. No mysterious sorting. Let's see how we can fix that. It was an easy fix. We just joined it with PG enum. We joined it on the two columns of interest. Notice I just typecast it to both of our chars, made sure they're equal, made sure that I used my enum type ID, uh, 17092, and pretty much that's the column I'm sorting by. And that was the end of that. Okay, team, thanks for hanging in there, and I'll see you back in my next video.